Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Civil Engineering Academy. My name's Cody. Let's go ahead and get started. So today we have a structural mechanics type of problem. And in particular, we're going to be talking about the uh, modulus of resilience and the modulus of toughness. Here's what the question says. Uh, what is the difference between the modulus of resilience and modulus of toughness? A, they are the same thing. B, modulus of resilience represents the amount of energy needed to fracture a material. Uh, modulus of toughness represents the amount of energy needed to yield a material. Uh, C is actually the reverse of that. So they're talking about fracture with toughness, uh, yielding with resilience. And then we have D, none of the above explanations are correct. Well, in order to understand what exactly this is, you can memorize it, but if you don't understand it, it's probably not gonna help you in the exam. I'm just gonna draw, in order to understand this, I'm gonna draw a graph. So we have strain on the X and then stress on the Y. Uh, and then our material does something like that, something like that, it's good enough, I guess. And uh, our yield point is right about here. And then our fracture point is obviously over here somewhere. Uh, not exactly drawn to scale, but uh, essentially what we're talking about is we have the modulus of resilience, modulus of toughness, modulus of resilience actually happens at the yield point. So if you took the area underneath the yield point, that is your modulus of resilience. Whereas with toughness, if you took the area under the curve for um, just about this entire thing, it looks like you did something like this, right? You found the area underneath the curve. That would be your modulus of toughness. So in this case, uh, it looks like, let's see here, modulus to fracture material. It looks like C is going to be your answer because the modulus of toughness is the area under the curve of the stress strain diagram at the fracture point. Uh, modulus of resilience is the area under the curve of the stress strain diagram uh, under your yield point. So up to your yield point and back to uh, where you didn't have any load applied to that, that is your modulus of resilience. So hey, I hope this video helps and we'll catch you next time.